some people see law as a privilege, some people see law as a step so that you can claim a social ladder. But when you come from a low-income family, the reality is that our experience with law was always violent. So I went into law school with a lot of resentment, but I also went into law school with a lot of hope about transformation, that that idea could change. My name is Ariadna Godro Albert. I am the founder and director of Ayuda Legal Puerto Rico, and we are a nonprofit located in San Juan, Puerto Rico. We became Clio clients in 2020. We promote legal education, legal support, but also the idea that legal advocacy is a tool for social change. Ayuda Legal Puerto Rico became a corporation the year that Mayor Hurricane and Maria hit Puerto Rico. Lights were out, the country was devastated by the hurricane. A lot of people had lost everything they had. And we were in the living room of our home thinking, what can we do to have legal work become relevant in this context where people is in so much need? Clio gives a digital platform that we can rely on. We have had the experience of having like massive power outages. So we know that having the records in the same place, having all of the communications in the same place, having documents on the same place that we can access remotely is very valuable to these processes. When a disaster comes in, courts usually go on. Eviction processes go on. Foreclosure processes go on. And we need something that's on a cloud that cannot be reached by those disasters. And Clio gives that to us. In Puerto Rico, there's a moving sense of impossibility with so many things. And I, and I have a lot of hope. I'm a mother, I, I need to, you know. And I have this complete belief that everything continues to be possible, but that we are short on time. So that we need to use everything that's in our power, every resource, including clean, to make things like smoother because we need to be here for a long run.